Did you know we have up to three different functions to calculate mod in Excel? We have the mod function, the mod.sngl or the mod.single function, and the mod.mult or the mod.multiple function. Now, what's the mod? The mod is the most frequent value in a data set. So let's see how to calculate the mod using these three functions. So I'm going to click on this cell and do equals to the mod. Down arrow, down arrow. When I see it highlighted in blue, I'm going to hit tab to select it. I'm simply going to highlight my numbers like this. When I hit enter, you can see the mod of this data set is 150. Now we can even clearly see from here, 150 is appearing two times and the rest of the numbers are appearing only once. That makes 150 to be our mod. Now let's also click on this cell and do equals to mod dot single tab to select it. I'm simply going to highlight my values like this. And when I hit enter, you can see we're also getting 150. So the mod dot single function and the mod function actually works the same way. Let's also see the mod dot multiple. So I'm going to click on this cell and do equals to mod dot multiple tab to select it. I'm simply going to highlight my values like this. When I hit enter, you can see all the three functions is actually giving us 150. That's because this data set is having only one mod. The difference between these functions is that the mod and the mod dot single function actually returns only one value. Even if your data set is having more than one mod, the mod function and the mod dot single function will only return for you the first mod it has bumped into. But the mod dot multiple will list for you all your mods. And the mod dot multiple is actually an array function. That means if the data set change, it automatically updates. Like for example, we have 70 here. If I'm to come here and change this one to 70, immediately I hit enter, you can see the mod dot multiple is actually capturing that 70 because our data set now has two mods. 150 and 70 is also appearing twice. But the mod function and the mod dot single function is only picking the first mod here. Again, if I'm to come here, we have 72 here. If I change this to 72 and hit enter, each and every time the data set is having more than one mod, the mods will be listed here. But the mod function and the mod dot single function will only pick for us the first mod they found.